Stanley Tucci. Yes. Welcome to the Late Show. Thanks. Love you so much. You're looking stylish. You're Thank looking you. hot. Thanks. And I, and, and I want those glasses. Thanks. We'll talk glasses after the okay. after the interview. All right. Um, I met. I need to get this right. I was in London last week, and I met a friend of your brother-in-law, Steve Carell. Your brother-in-law. That's the connection with Steve Carell. Oh who my I interviewed God! Last of course, week. John. John Krasinski. Yes. Yes, who because they did Jen? this show together. The Office. Of course. So the Blunts. You're married to Emily Blunt's sister. Sister. And the sister is... Is married to John. Is married to, to John, John. Who did the show with Steve. Steve on The Office. So there is a wee connection you're there. You're right. You're absolutely right. And that's my tenuous link between yourself and, and Steve, Steve Carell. Carell. And do you know that you give bold men hope on this planet? Really? Because you're number eight in the world of sexiest bald men. Did you know that stat? <laughs> no, I didn't. You're no. number eight in the world. Really? Andre Agassi is number seven. Really? And number one, who do you think the number one sexiest bald man on the planet is? The Hollywood Rock. actor. The Rock. No, he's not. You're ahead of The Rock. Jason? No. Uh, yippee ki yay, mother. Bruce? Bruce Willis is the sexiest bald man on the planet. You're number eight. He's not my type, but all right. <laughs> yeah. I had no idea, but I'm very flattered. I read that you work out five to six times a week. Yes. True? Yes. An hour every time. Oh, yeah. Oh, why? I have to. I feel better if I do. I feel bad if I don't. So, so what would your advice be to someone like me who likes to sit down in front of the TV with a bag of chips and some wine and a bottle of beer? Just... just that's a really disgusting combination. But I think I just saw it all, and I just thought, even if you work out, don't do that. Um, I like to do it because I like to eat. I like to have a martini. I like to have wine. I love going out to dinner and making dinner. So in order to indulge in those things, you kind of have to offset it. <laughs> By working out as By much as you out. do. working out, yeah, yeah, now, yeah. talking to dinner and talking to food, uh, you're also a food lover yeah. and an author. Yeah. Have you got a food book, a cookbook yeah. thing out? You have. Yeah. Um, I, I read somewhere that you've got so many bugbears when it comes to food. And I'm, I'm going to read some of these out individually. Just need, I just want your reaction to each of these bugbears that you apparently have. Yeah, Okay. all right. Inappropriate use of ketchup. Yes. That's a bugbear of yours. Yeah, yeah. So I couldn't put ketchup on a curry. I wouldn't no. do that, no. No. So what's, in your opinion, what's inappropriate about, about ketchup? I really think ketchup belongs on a hamburger. Yeah. And that's about it. Salting without tasting is another bugbear of yours. Outrage. An outrage? It's an outrage, yes. Why? Because well, you have to know, maybe it has too much salt already. Maybe it doesn't have enough, but then you don't even know how much it needs unless you taste it. Good tip. I need to tell my wife about that because yeah. it always comes out too salty. What? When my you, wife. No, not my wife. wife. No, the, wife, the, the cooking that my wife does is quite salty because really? she's not tasting it. That's what it is. Yeah. People who make salad and main on one plate. Mm. Mm. A salad with a main on one plate. Mm. So good. a salad should be a side dish. Yes. Or it should ideally come after the meal. At the end of the meal. The salad after the meal, what to salad cleanse after the meal because it helps cleanse your palate, helps you digest, and, and the vinegar alkalizes your system. It's good. I need to get your cookbook, by the way. Uh, people who cut their pasta. <laughs> it's a criminal act, unless you're a child, <laughs> or you've had a, or you've had a stroke. You know, I'm sorry, I don't mean to be, but you can, you can't, you can't do it. And the other one is excessive amounts of cheese is a bugbear of yours. Yeah. So you don't like a cheesy pizza? No, there's no need. It's just then it's, you're losing all those beautiful layers of flavor. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to have to buy your cookbook, by the way. Do it. Buy I'm, it. I'm going yeah. to buy it. Give yeah. it to my wife for her birthday. Yeah. <laughs> wow, look at that timing. Well, look at that my cocktail. Thank you so much. Can I have a little ketchup with this, please? <laughs> kidding, kidding. Quick fire round. Batman or Superman? Yes. <laughs> Kiss on a first date, yes or no? Yeah. Oh yeah. Uh, granny pants or thongs? Hmm. Neither. N 
I, what, pantless? Better, just, just <laughs> leave it all out. Boxers or briefs? Briefs. Briefs. Never wore boxers? No, no, you're uncomfortable. See, I'm a briefs guy as well, because I like to have it in yeah. position. Yeah, I don't like the flopping, do you know what I mean? Leather or lace? I can't answer that. <laughs> What do you think Steve said? What? What do you think Steve said? I, he actually screamed it, he was that excited. Leather! Yeah. <laughs> uh, shower or bath? What? Shower or bath? Oh, shower. Shower. Um, favourite dance move? Favourite dance move? Yeah. Just spinning a girl. Spinning a girl yeah. into your yeah. arms? Yeah. Oh, you're too cool to be it. true, by the way, Just man. Lipstick or lip gloss? Oh, uh, lipstick. Sugar or spice? Spice. What colour is your toothbrush? Well, I have a lot of them. You have a lot? Yeah. One for each day? I'm sort of, yeah, yeah I clean my teeth a lot. Right, okay. Yeah. Cats or dogs? Neither. Well, you, if you had to have one in your house... Not a dog. A dog, because cats no, are evil. No, I guess a cat. No, a cat, because you don't have to pay attention cats to it. Cats are evil! Nobody cat likes cats! No, oh, fuck <laughs> Beer or wine? Who? Beer or wine? Ah. Uh, Wine. Wine. And finally, your favourite swear word, Stanley Tucci.